All right, well, uh, the water crisis in Flint continues making headlines nationally. And protesters are on the move in Flint right now, and that's where our Mara McDonald is live tonight. Mara? Hi, Guy. They sure are on the move. Take a look. Protesters have been walking around the city tonight. Uh, they're returning right now to the front lawn here at Flint City Hall, which is where this protest started earlier this evening. And it was a protest the likes of which we haven't seen in quite a while. We are talking an illuminated arrest Snyder now sign. We even had a paper mache head of the governor in prison stripes. Uh, but something to remember here. A lot of the people who are out here protesting are not from Flint and have not had to deal with the lead in the water, but they came to show solidarity. However, we did manage to find somebody in this crowd who is from Flint, who has been living with this. And he tells us that even though they have changed to Detroit water and they have free water filters, he doesn't feel safe drinking the water. Even with the filters, okay. I do not trust that water because, for one, all residents in the city of Flint has not been, um, they water with the filters has not been tested. So we're not for sure. They told us that the water was good before. We still drunk the water. So to tell us that using filters, is the trust is completely gone. Back here alive. So you can see protesters are still marching as we speak. I'll tell you one thing. This crisis has become the number one topic up in the legislature in Lansing and exactly how the state of Michigan is going to pay to make this right. We are live in Flint tonight. Mara McDonald, Local 4.